Do you know what the most popular Japanese winter dish? Three, two, one. It's nabe, Japanese hot pot. Nabe is not only easy to make, but it also warms up the body, making it perfect for the winter. So today I'd like to introduce three nabe dishes suitable for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Okay, let's get started. Lately, I've been trying to wake up at 4 o'clock. I usually drink smoothies and matcha, but today I'm gonna make nabe this morning. You don't wanna eat a heavy meal in the morning, right? Me too. So I'm gonna make light vegan sesame soy light vegan sesame soy milk hot pot. How to make soup stock? Preparing ingredients How to make soup While doing that, I'll go on the work and do some workout It's still really dark, hey? After coming back, I started making soup Add ingredients and cook over high heat until boiling. You can put bean sprouts after that. Cook over low heat for 3 minutes and you're done. In the morning. Today is a national holiday, so I went to the forest to hang out. This is the route that I always run. Just walking around made me feel so relaxed. When I went up, I saw cows that grazing the mountains. I met some friends and made organic matcha lattice here. Making matcha while taking in the vast scenery was amazing. Lunch. For lunch, I'm thinking of making a classic Japanese hot pot dish, which is chanko nabe. Chanko nabe is nutritionally balanced and famous as that small wrestlers often eat. And it's easy to make, so I really recommend it. How to make soup stock? How to prepare ingredients? After that, put all the ingredients and heat it up until it's boiled. And then it's done. Okay, let's eat. Here too. Oh, this is so nice. Do you know what makes it more delicious? It's sake. Yes. So, we usually drink sake uh, while eating nabe. Because the synergistic effect of the umami of sake and the hot pot makes it more delicious. What I'm drinking now is the sake that I received from Tipsy Sake, who kindly sponsored this video. Tipsy Sake is a company that offers sake subscription service and delicious sake products carefully selected from Japan throughout the US. Including rare sake you can't get normally. Sige is dry and clear, so it goes really well with a hot pot or any food. This is great! Anyway, when you eat chicken dumplings, you should be careful because it's really hot. <laughs> Do you know what makes it even more delicious? I'll show you. First, 
put yuzu kosho in it. Oh my god, so much flavor. Oh, I love it. Second, warm up sake. So, let me explain how to make warm sake. Wow! So it came closer to body temperature, so it's more easy to drink. It gets milder and smoother. I really love it. Eating delicious nabe and drinking Nihonshu sake. This is the best combination in winter. If watching after this video, you want to enjoy hot pot and sake, you can order it from Tipsy Sake. If you use discount code Samurai Matcha 23, you can get 10% off all products, except Sake subscription service. Maybe you can buy Suige. I'll put the link in the description below. Please check it out if you are interested in after watching this video. As for dinner, I'm gonna make a seafood herb pot. Let's get started. How to make soup stock. Let's prepare ingredients. Okay, let's add some ingredients into the soup stock. Heat it up for a while on medium heat. Open the lid and put some cheese on it. And heat it up for a while on medium heat again. Ta-da! Mm. Wow, this soup is amazing. I feel like I'm in Italy. I'm gonna drink warm sake again as well. I drank sake this time, but I thought wine would go along well with this nabe. These ingredients of seafood hard pot is relatively easy to find overseas, so please try making it. So today I introduced three nabe dishes that I like. What did you think about it? So, like if your country is really cold now, still now, I would recommend you to make nabe. It's okay, you can eat by yourself, but it's kind of lonely, like me, so I would recommend you to eat it with your friends so that you can enjoy drinking sake as well. Okay, so stay safe, have fun, and thank you for watching as usual. I hope to see you in the next video. Bye-bye!